Is it? Scooter and something because Mike. Scooter and B. Uh, yo, yo, yo. What's going on? It's your main man, Hum B. And your boy DB. Hey, this is the Truck Cast, uh, episode number 70. 71. 71. 71. Episode number 71 of the Truck Cast. And you know what we do here. Yeah, we, do. we talk about relationships. We talk about relationships. We talk about love. love. Uh, we talk about. We talk about dating issues. Dating issues. Uh, marriage sometimes. <laughs> I mean, that is the end goal. And we talk about how to stay in love. Stay together and stay in love longer than 60 days. Huh. See what I'm saying? 60. We, get a, we, we, we get a reaction every time. Uh, Six zero. Hey, this is a special episode. That's why we're on late. Um, it's birthday season. Birthday season. It's what, what's the sign? Leo. Uh, it's the, is, the, is it Kansas? Kansas? No, it's Leo. 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 Birthday Leo. season. Lion King. <laughs> I just seen. Hey, that that boy B in the truck. Holla back at what you. Up? Boy. What up? What up? What up? What up? Hey, happy birthday, brother. Man, appreciate you. Dog. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm saying another. And year. we always have it. to set it up for our fans, man. <laughs> our Mike, true truck up. casters that really hold it down for us. And really show us love. Yes, sir. Uh, that boy B. We got Jared coming through. Yeah, I got Jared coming uh, through. We got cousin Mike cousin in the Mike back of the truck. What up, cousin Mike? Day. What's up? In the building. I'm in the building. Oh, okay. I'm in the building. I'm in the building. What up, cousin Mike? We're going down. Sure. You say sixty days. Try three years, man. That's the. After three years, that's that's it. That's when it's it, right there. So that's the that's the limit. You two and a half, three. If you survive after three, then it's official. It's it's kind it's of it's official with as long as you well, you learn something days, new every night. night. Damn, learn something new. Learn something. Learn something. What yeah, yeah, hit that man. bullshit? So three so, years, huh? Three years, years, man. If you ain't three years, then you. What are you? Yeah, coming over the hump, man. Three years. So man, we say sixty look. days because we, you know how it is. You sixty get, days ain't nothing. It, it ain't nothing. That's two you, months, two, you, three months. You man. in and out of yeah. relationships What's all the, the time. You know we started off a serious. Nineteen, man. Yeah, man. Stick around for nothing. They don't man. stick around. They don't stick around. They don't stick around. If they, they what? They, I, I don't want to speak. Man. But if they don't, I want to find somebody real quick. Fine. You want to find somebody real quick, girl? Okay. Hey guys, happy birthday to Jared. Happy birthday to Bernard. Yo, we, got a, hey, we got a couple other birthday guests that's coming man. in too. Thank you. Oh, so it's a whole bunch of birthdays. Oh, yeah. Yes, we have another young yes. lady. Yes. Come season, like, baby. Let's go. Birthday. Let's hey, get it's it. going down in a major way. No truck fashion tonight. We just no gonna get into fashion. it and talk that There's shit. The whole reason I was on the show, man. Man. They, Everybody say that. To put my input on, everybody man. wanted to say. I mean, I hey, man. The this was this was birthday <laughs> season. That's what I'm talking about. And we was just gonna just talk that shit. Anytime, every time. You know what I'm saying? I take it. I like that. You like that? Yeah. So I was talking to a, um, I was talking to a young lady today. You know how it goes. Mm-hmm. Whoop whoop wham wham. Yeah, no, you, must, you must got some real good stuff right here. Whoop whoop wham wham, and um, <laughs> she just we got into a little debate, a little tiff. Okay. Not even a tiff, a debate. I wanted. Okay. We got we got into a debate, and I was like, you know what? Can we? It seems like we can't. Get along without arguing, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and I said it's a debate, though. Okay, but it's but it turned into like a low key argument. Okay, so and we was always like talking over each other, talking over each other, like that. Damn, man, damn, you just can't be damn. right. Damn. You want to like, be heard? I know you want to be. I'm gonna she be quiet, be and then when you done, I'm gonna talk. Mm-hmm. But then no, 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 she don't want that. Yep. She don't want that. So, the question is, can you stay with the person that you can't affect the community? That's always argumentative, talking over each other. Mm-hmm. I mean, you can't get your point across. I, I think, yeah. I think, I think once you once you realize that you that your significant other y'all cannot communicate effectively, yeah. then y'all gotta find ways to to learn how to communicate effectively. You know what I'm saying? Because like. I had a relationship where we did that such thing. We talked over to one right. another. All we did right. was was fighting fuss, and it was, it was like very being condescending remarks mm-hmm. that happened all the time yes. during the during the arguments. That's kind of that type of relationship won't work. You know, she you gotta hurts. break down, and somebody gotta be the she bigger person and be like, "Yo, man, this ain't gonna work mm-hmm. unless, unless we, right. somebody becomes mature." And uh, you know, right? And uh, you know, hey, let's stop all the goddamn arguing. Right? Oh yeah, tonight, yeah, we're drinking on um, the uh, Saturday. 
Hey, oh, really, buddy, goody. Really you know brought that shit back. It, Episode seventy one. Love it. Brought back the salad neck with a hey, good cut crack. I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> what you think, cousin Mike? Cousin hey, Mike, can you deal with a woman that's argumentative? What well, What my motto I live by is uh -oh. is what you see is what you get. Ah uh ha! -huh. You know what I'm saying? Ah uh ha! -huh. You know we gotta. Well, hold on. What you, like, what you mean by that? Like, what you mean? Like, what you see? What you what you see is what you get. Wait, what huh? you see? So what you trying to flip and dip and trying to trying to change and mm -hmm. alter? Mm -hmm. That's what that's what it is. No, like, you can't change them. You what can't change them. Mm -hmm. You can't change them. You know that's the problem when we try mm -hmm. to. Right. To to change them and we think that hey we talking we right. fighting against ourselves man. Stacy Stacy Michelle said, but were you listening to respond or listening to understand? When you when you arguing, are you listening to respond or listening arguing. to understand? It's See, not arguing. I don't argue. It, it turned into it. It turned into arguing. I'm lying. You can't do that, baby. I'm lying. I'm lying. Argue, but, but I just want to talk to you. It turned into arguing. Yeah, I don't argue. Where she's talking over me. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get my point across. Mm -hmm. But uh, to no avail. Mm -hmm. You know. The sky is blue. Right. No, she says it's green. That type. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just well, to start, just to start something. I mean, if you're doing that, then as always, you know you got to pick your battles, man. Yeah, you do. You so I should just hush my. I mean, if she telling you it's, it's green and you know it's blue. That's and just an example. That's, but what were we? That's just, 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 just let it be. Just let it be. Okay, is that what you want to do tonight? Just okay. You know, I always let it wrong tomorrow. We'll talk about it again anyway. Mm -hmm. You know, we'll bring yeah, it up. Get nowhere, though. We're going to laugh about it. Yeah. We we'll later on, that when she want to laugh about it. Yeah, I mean. When she want to laugh about it. When she want to laugh about it. See, I got to wait. I got to wait on that. But what about when you want to laugh about it? When you in your mood. I wanted to laugh about it in the moment. You got your t it's, so every conversation you want to laugh about it in the moment. It's certain no. conversations you want to leave alone at that time and period. You just don't want to talk about it today. See, it sounds like you're speaking for the woman. Though. I'm speaking for both sides. Mm, I'm speaking for the woman. So <laughs> you want so when you argue, mm -hmm. you want to talk about it every time no, uh, all again time and get it out the way or uh, debate. It becomes I mean, you an want, argument. Just because in the majority of the time, women always make you wrong anyway. Mm -hmm. They always make you the wrong. You know what I'm saying? So. Right. It's gonna yeah. be like and, that, and then yeah, you have yeah, to show right. concrete evidence. Oh, why you, you not? Cannot at, show concrete at, at, evidence. No, no, you can't. And once you do show concrete evidence, okay. you guess wrong. what she says? You still wrong? Oh, oh well. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's it. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, can we do that too, though? Mm -hmm. Do we do that too? No, do. we can, but like, why? Why do that? Why we can't brush it off? I, mean, like, what, what, I don't want to make it. I don't want to make it a. But once you make your point, I'm done talking about it. I'm I don't want to make it a double standard. Is, is, would that turn into a double standard? I mean, she, she do it. Why not? We can't do it. So 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 if if, if, you, if, if, if uh -huh. I'm sorry, because but if if you'd have made your point, now this time you walked away from. Okay, you know what? You're right. You know what I'm saying? Right now it might be petty. I don't want to say things that's going to take us out of line and I'm going to say something that hurt and mm -hmm. be mad about. Right. Okay, so then when the time comes, now it's my time. Hey, mm -hmm. I'm done talking about it. Let's let it be. We'll talk about it tomorrow when mm -hmm. we both feeling good. Mm -hmm. That's how everything get, you know what I'm saying, misconstrued mm -hmm. and right. just thrown out of proportion right, right. on that same day. Mm -hmm. Then maybe once you learn that and she mm -hmm. learned it, like, okay, well, maybe that's what we need to do. Mm -hmm. Talk about it another day. Hmm. Calm that situation now. Calm it down first, because right now we just both eat it. Eat some ice cream and cake. You know what I'm saying? Because right now I'm feeding off my ego, hmm. and she's feeding off her feelings. Hmm. You just said some things that came to me that I just, right. like, man, right now, you know. And tomorrow I'm going to be like, dang, why did I say that? Or even remember. Hmm. Don't even remember why you said it. Y'all right. gone? And then what? And then go our relationship in turmoil behind some, you know, right, something. Right. Just, but even though we both could have. Somehow, some way, said it in a different manner. Mm -hmm. But here we are now. And that, and that's. But I'm with what you see. Yeah, right? it, that's why it's kind. Of, and then that turns into. If that's a, is that if that's a wrestling match all day every day, it if, takes you deal, two, if, you, if you if you it takes two, it takes but two. if you're dealing with that all day every day, mm -hmm. it turns into difficulty in a relationship. So how can you how can you get out of that hole? Either we're going to talk about it or we can't right. come to agreement on things. Then I, I can say that's that's when oh, you got to oh, stop. Oh, oh, that's when you got to say, okay, well, this, this relationship is toxic. Now we got to leave it alone. Yes. If we yes, both yes, can't yes, yes. at some man, point let it go. When a man come to a point yeah. and say, hey, man, 
You know, because females, right now, they, they play that. They play that. Yeah. They play that. Uh, you what know, they can go but, back and forth. But they play because of Mike. What they play? They play that. They play that role. But we got to like, be strong, you know too, though, because, you know. Because they want to win at the end. Mm. What up, Quinn? Yeah. What up, Stacey? What up, Janir? What they up, Chris Jones? We might be strong at the Everybody that's watching. But remember, you know, a week or two, might go by there and was like, damn, I sure need some pussy. And now tonight, what we gonna do? Right. Either I'ma subject her what she went through with me last time to get this, or yeah. I still gonna stay strong and say, yeah. forget it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or I'ma go out, or now I gotta go out somewhere, you know, go to a bar, sit in here for a couple of hours, right. buy right. some drinks, right. Yeah, 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 or yeah, I can yeah, go yeah. get this easy access real quick. Mm. Right. But it's like that. You know what I'm saying? Like that easy access. So it's 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 how you gonna make it. That was everything, coach. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it can't. That's how you're going to make it at that time. And, and Shout out to Everything Culture Podcast. Shout out to Everything Culture. We'll have them on later. But you can play that role with them females you that you want. Mm -hmm. as, as long as you want. The ball has to be in your court. Right. But at some point, mm -hmm. you all got to come together. I got a bunch of them. Nah, but hand they ain't that, trying to make it. Hand me that folder back there that's behind me. Oh, that folder's on folders. Yeah, I want to see what questions. We should ask. How do, how, do y how, do y how do you guys feel about um, your significant other? Like, let's say you get you get caught up in a situation, your significant other uh, takes you back. How do you feel? Significant other? What, what, is, what, is, it, what is a significant other? This girlfriend. Yeah, girlfriend. 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 Your gal. Girlfriend. Chick you mess with your gal. Whatever. G A L. Your gal. Okay, your gal. Your gal. Your gal. Not your, your fuck buddy, but your gal. Yeah, your gal. How you feel about your gal? You done been caught up. You done been messed up. You didn't get caught up. You didn't. You didn't. You didn't got caught doing a little wrong. You weren't necessarily cheap, but you was doing wrong. Right. And she put you on trial every day about that. Mm -hmm. Now you, in my mind, I feel like she chose to stay. How do you feel about being on trial every day? Man, being, once oh. you get once you get caught, mm -hmm. once you get in that little situation, he, he man, he you need to go ahead and move he around. He know. You need to move around. You need to move. Why around. not fight? Cause Mike, you sound experienced. Cause Mike, man, why hey, not man, cause, cause they why ain't not gonna let that shit down, dog. You gotta be clean, man. You gotta keep that shit clean, dog. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't need that stuff because right. they and they back in them females' mind. Right. They gonna always have it, mm -hmm. this and that, this and that, mm -hmm. and they waiting to use that. <laughs> Female they issues. They waiting to use. Yeah, them. so you might as well. They got, they got, they got that bullet That's loaded at all you, time. If you right. miss, if you misjudged or miscalculated. Right. Uh, messed up mm -hmm. somehow. Right. You need to just take that charge and move around, mm -hmm. man. Cause all that begging and pleading and mm -hmm. like, like uh, my fault. Kobe, mm -hmm. Kobe tried to put the ring on. Hey, he go buy a he bigger did ring. The ring and he already was she, did was that. she with him shooting in the gym? Uh, yeah, she I think so. Good. They still man, she still got that on the back of his. Know, right, still got that, right. huh? Yeah, man. Still got Them that. females don't let that So down. forgive, but you got forgive, but don't forget, type. Oh, what's her name? Yeah, I think everybody does that, though. Oh, right? Curry's saying she don't get enough attention, though. How you feel about Ice? that on on the man's side? Ooh, we, well, Do we she, let that go? She saying she saying what she have on her mind. Though. Do we let that go? And then she did it on a public forum. So, so, so a, what you what you man. think Curry should do? You should say, okay, I'm gonna listen to my girl. <laughs> As a man, and, what did you do though, man? Because so now, and, and, so and now the, most the pool guy that came over today. Hey, you, girl, you better believe the pool guy. You didn't get no attention today. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, you not getting no attention. <laughs> yeah, and Curry, he started staring that pool Curry water. What's up, boy? He's some threes right now. He playing basketball. Head. That's why, yeah, that's oh, why I say, yo, I gotta hurt him in this game. Like he was. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. I'm just saying. Hey, Ooh, bro, those are all scenarios that do that. Tank top up, yeah, huh? With a tank uh, top up. Oh, oh, no, bro. Oh, 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 everybody's favorite. Yeah, you all right? You got a tank top on? Everybody's favorite. Uh -huh. The plumber. <laughs> <laughs> Let's lay this pipe down, baby. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's clogged up. God damn. It ain't been touched yeah. in a while. Oh, I, I had a female before tell me <laughs> every time you? Uh, uh, you you show up, mm -hmm. you need to hug me. What? Hmm? You know what I'm saying? You uh -huh. need to show me, you know, in front Affection. of all. Know, but what, that's, that's her. What's this female you messing to, with? Yeah, I was with my girlfriend. Oh, okay. My that's gal. Cow. Right, babe. But she wants GAL. Well, yeah, but she wants Damn. when I show up for me to, hey baby, hug. Because I'm the type of dude that, you know, we, we keep Aces. that, you know. Yeah. She wanna kiss right. in public. Right. You know? right. Right. Relationships. She Staying together longer than Yeah, she wants to, but it's for her to get attention for people to see. Really, to me. So are we faking mm. it then? You just showing yeah, out? Yeah, yeah, showing out, man. Mm. They want to so show. The they want people. They want people right. to see. You think that? Hey, good? look, look, I got this dude. Because you the trophy. He taking care of me. He over uh, taking care of me, man. I had a chick tell me you that like before. That? 
You stick with you know what I'm saying? You know what like, tricks want, Jay? Huh? Dude, they want to be taken care of. What you think about that? Mike, you cool with that, man? Shout out to Cousin Mike. <laughs> you cool with that, Cousin Mike? Man, man dog. I, I need to be taken care of, too. I heard that, Cousin Mike. I told, that's why I told that chick back at her. I said, hey, told? I want to I wanna be taken care of, too. She said, you know what? Security. That's the word she used. You know what all chicks want? They want security. security. I respect I said, you. You know what? You know what? I want security, too. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. We're going to see what the crowd doing out here, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go ahead, go ahead and do your thing. We got to talk to Cousin Mike. Right, cousin man, Mike. I didn't been in a lot of time, man. Hey, Cousin Mike. Cousin, cousin Mike, cousin cousin Mike. Cousin when you say Mike, security, man. man, what you mean by security? security. I don't know tell, what she meant tell, by security. Uh, I guess to make her feel like she don't need, if she don't want to work, she don't have to work. Cousin Mike. All right. Yeah. Yeah, man. So, anyways, mm -hmm. no, it's gonna be gone. Man, speak the truth, cause Mike, you're telling you, man. These relationships, are something else, man. Mike, Mike, what can you say? Are you are you currently in a relationship now? No. You single? Yeah. I'm <laughs> Why you at that pause? Because Why you at the pause? If you ain't married, you single. Why you at the pause? It ain't no, bro. it ain't no black and white. If you ain't married, you single. If you ain't married, you single. You single. Okay. If you ain't married, you single okay. Bro. Okay. Well, are you involved with somebody? Do you have a significant other? That's why I say significant other. Nah. Gal. Nah, I ain't galling. I ain't galling. All right, see your date. Gallin. So, Mike, what did you learn from your past relationship? I just told you. <laughs> that she wanted security. They want security. No, no, no. What you see is what you get. Don't don't think that. Don't think that uh, 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 you doing this and doing that and doing this, you're going to change their mind. Because mm. their minds is their minds, though. You gone? Don't be asking me no hard questions. No, we ain't asking no hard questions. Jump in. You gonna jump in? You gonna go? Jump in. I'm getting that female perspective. perspective. Huh? Y'all make me nervous. Come on. Oh, Come on. Right now, my relationship. It's birthday I'm episode. Nervous. I'm shaking. I'm trembling. Give birthday me your name. Episode. Give me your name. Your sign and all that. Give me your name. name. Scoot in so they can see. Give me, give me, okay. give me your hip hop name or your, or your, or your. Name. When you trying to get rid of that dude name. that you don't want to talk to, give me. My a, name is Sarah. Shout out to Sarah. Hello, Sarah. Sarah Lee. Okay, Sarah. Sarah, when you out and about, yes. when you out and about, first of all, um, what's your sign? I'm a Taurus, a terrific Taurus. Ooh, wee. Uh, when you ask somebody, okay, so when you uh, when you out and about yep. and you, you, you join your friends and you have a guy approach you, yes. What do you expect from a guy when he approaches you? Like, like, like what are the things that you look forward to? Mm -hmm. what, what do you think that, that what, what would attract you to a male that approach you? For him to at least be articulate. Mm -hmm. Can you hold a conversation? Can mm -hmm. you approach me with respect? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you, is there a certain no, type no, no, of no, uh, no. physical? Well, I don't want a midget, so I need you to have some sort of height. Oh, Can you get politically correct? I'm uh, sorry. Um, <laughs> I don't want you to be vertically challenged. Oh! Mm -hmm. I like that one. Okay. Vertical challenge. Hold enough. the conversation. Mm -hmm. Tall enough. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> <laughs> physical, oh, physical. Yeah, because I have lovely long legs and I wear lots of um, high heels, so you know. Yeah. How tall are you? I'm five seven. Mm, so right at least there. four inches right on, there. then you have it. Right there. So, right. Like, so you I, want your guy to be taller than you when y'all take a picture. Or I don't necessarily need him to be chin length, you know, just like right here, but you know. Call it like you see. I want a taller lady. You know what I'm saying? Okay. You want somebody taller than me. Okay. Mm. So you want to look up to her? I want to look up to her and grab her. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. I mean, you know. Yeah, teachers, huh? Like exactly. love next you know, to <laughs> Let me ask this question. What were we talking about? We were talking about the... Hmm? Let me just ask a new question. Yeah, ask a new question. All right, so when you're in a relationship, when was your last relationship? Can we ask that? Are you currently in a relationship? Are you I'm, single? I, I am single. Single as a bitch. So I, heard, I, heard, I, heard you, I heard you're single until you're married, though. Exactly. That's what Cousin Mike said. Little Cousin Mike said. So yeah, that's, that's your belief, he too. He didn't put no ring on it. Mm. So mm. you believe in that, Miss Sarah? So, Sarah, you're single until you're married. When I check that box on that application, it says single. Uh -huh. I still got my daddy's last name. Has mm -hmm. it been changed? Oh, no. uh, okay. Get it right. Won't do it. Not even promise ring? No. I'm <laughs> way too damn old for the promise ring. Right. Yeah. Uh, promise? Well, the basis ring. Right. Stick out of jacket ain't 2001. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let me see. You leave late. Well, okay. well, no. Everybody no, has know. a cup but me. What is going on here? Oh, we, oh, are they, we ain't even know. Ooh, ladies yeah. first. Ladies first. I, I didn't even know. We don't, we don't, we don't uh, yeah. That's a Unless you want to take it to the head like a jig. Salonac. Um, Salonac. Well, Kanye. We in here. Yeah, we got to get some cups. Yeah. We got to get some okay. cups. Uh, let me see. 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 Let
I need a I need a female with some. I don't want to get on the show. Oh, they do? They're not getting high. No, they're not getting high. Oh, they're not getting high. They be like, Jay, what that little dude doing with that tall female right there? Uh. I got this. All right, here we go. Do we, this is for you, since I'm you're the only woman in here. Mm -hmm. Do women date uh, for potential because they're afraid of missing out, or do you date for potential just because that's what you want? Well, listen. What? Listen to the question now. Are you dating for potential now? Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. you're afraid. You date for potential because you're afraid of missing out. No, I don't have any fear. So, mm. so why do you date for potential? If you do date for potential, or do you just date how it comes to you, and you deal with it? You deal with the guy like. Well, it right. depends on what the guy brings to the table. Mm. So, if he brings nothing to the table and I see potential, then I'm dating for potential. But if he comes to the table meeting me with what I'm bringing to the table, then that's just a power couple in the making. Mm. And then, and then you have to deal with attitudes. How to do dress? Can you? Are you? You in the changing dudes? No, I just wanted to throw I mean, it out there to see I what you would say. I just need to compliment me, and if you're unable to do that, then you'll have some problems. How do? How do? How is? How does one man compliment? Yes, Miss Miss Sarah. G, she just said the the the, the terrific Taurus. Like, how can he compliment you? Give me a specific. A, a, maybe. Well, I mean, if we're going out mm -hmm. and you know we're going to Paris, you need not just show up in scrubs and a shirt. Well, but if we're going to Paris, I ain't been to Paris in the park. Fresh off What's the part? Because I mean, I've been to Paris I mean, twice Paris, now, so I'm going to Paris in uh, jean shorts and a t-shirt. So if I'm gonna have a well, I mean, dress and we're going to okay. Frisco, so we're going right. So so basically, dress know, so dress, yeah, dress according to you. Okay. Right. Yeah. Now if right. we're going to Walmart, I mean we could just throw on some shorts and a t-shirt. Understood. But, like okay. you're going to Target or whatever. Mm -hmm. But I mean if we're going to a Christmas party, a cocktail hour where you have to dress accordingly, mm -hmm. then don't come in jeans. And so some some, shoes. some guys come like that, huh? Guys, be able to yeah. adapt. Yeah. Like, Miss yeah, yeah, Sarah yeah. saying, be able to adapt yeah, you have to, to your flexible, situation. You have to be okay. flexible and right. adaptable to the occasion. Right. Be, I mean, be, I don't be a chameleon, hard. brother. Mm. Be able to change them colors like mm. it ain't nothing. Mm. I mean, I can change, so you can change. Right. I mean, it's just about your flexibility and adaptability. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's you know mm. impossible. So you're you're a tourist, right? Terrific tourist. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I like to call them nothing. Anyway, uh. <laughs> I'm not gonna say that. The back of your head is yeah, just wide open. The back open. of my head is wide open. <laughs> yeah, Crazy. neck. Um, I think that Taurus is, you know, they are very stubborn. Would, would you consider yourself stubborn in a relationship? Can you find your stubbornness? I'm aiming to cut you off. Can you find your? I'm not one of the greatest motherfuckers of all time. Uh, I believe that. Yes. I believe. Yes. I believe that your stub. Do you believe that your stubbornness has, has maybe hindered you in the past in a relationship? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, I own that. I own that I'm stubborn. I own that I'm spoiled. I own that I'm strong. Spoiled? Oh. Yeah, absolutely. You can blame it on my daddy. But, but you only have to the daddy for spoiling. Right. Yeah, yeah. I am. I am. You live towards at the end of the day, if, you know, them being the way they are, mm -hmm. they find that gullible or guy that, that, that to miss. I guess what I want to say the word submissive to. Mm -hmm. Yep, mm -hmm. yep. You yeah, know, that, 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 they'll find that. That guy that they can uh, not me because I kind of push over. Him. No, yeah. I won't respect him. If I can push you over, if I can right. run over you, then I'm not gonna respect you. Well, well, then, well, so, so you so want, I need somebody that can handle me. I know somebody yeah. that's a tourist that I see their relationship. I'm like, man, God. The God. guy, the guy she's dating is submissive. He, he, oh, yeah, he, 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 she, she kind of, you she know, run him. she runs the situation. Yeah, but yeah, no, I won't yeah. respect a man like it. that. I wouldn't want to be in a relationship with men like that because my personality is too strong. Okay. So you have to be able to handle me. Now, I'm not going to just let what? you just put you your hands on me as far as handling me, but you have to be able to, like, handle my personality and, and stand up. Like, I need you to have a smile and a backbone. Like, just don't let me run over you. Mm. Yeah. Oh, that, I mean, I guess, well, I should ask both of you guys this question since you guys talked about it. Why do men and women have a hard time submitting to each other in a relationship? Because if I'm not your wife, then I don't have to submit to you. I can well, respect you and respect you as the man. But you're in, in a relationship. relationship. Yes, but as a husband, he's going to get that submissive part of me, not the boyfriend. There's a totally difference there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I guess so. Mm -hmm. You And you agree? You agree, customer? Yeah, I agree. I agree. I've been mm -hmm. in that situation before. But know? guess what? You guys been together for seven years. Mm. That's what I'm not going to do. Uh-huh. You need to piss it off the pot. Mm. Seven years? Are you kidding me? 
you know whether you want to be with her within the first six months or a year. You can't put sixty yeah, on the phone. Yeah, and see, no. that's why I, I, I say give it three years. Sixty days. Nah, you can't piss sixty days, on the pot. It take three years, man. Three so years. Sixty, so you, so 60 days. Pass, you still be on the pot. You still, you still trying to. I didn't say sixty days. No, we said sixty days. I said six months to a year. Sixty days. That's yeah, something y'all put up. Even six sixty months. days, I can still take something back with a receipt. You still a, so a I, year. I mean, I'm come still. On now. She but said like, that shit. Yeah, she's dead. I'm good receipt You said that wrong one? Where that target receipt is. Right. Like, oh, man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but like, like, real, like, I'm not saying 60 days. I mean, you know, I'm saying six months to a year. You right. either know I am going to be the one we can grow mm. on together. Six months to a year. It's not going to take no seven years. I don't have that kind of patience in my or life. Seven I years, yeah. Like that. I, I say three years. I don't say right. Uh, right. You three know, years. He just, so you just say that. You want me to run in place for three years? Three oh, years. So how long, so how long should you three date years. before you co commit? Like, the from month, from day zero, so one when year. you meet me. So six months, you're so, getting to know me. Six right. months okay. to a year, you can determine whether you want to spend the rest of your life. So with me. one year, one year. So let me let me interject. A baby learns to walk in one year. How much more expectation do you have? Let me interject Man. something else in there because you said from a point to to where the the guy knows you, mm -hmm. and is that a sexual encounter or that's just the encounter? It depends. I, yeah. I can't say. I can't. I can't put any limitations on that because that's not black and white. It's mm -hmm. all shades and of gray. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Right. Hey, tell tell them all the people come on. Tell Bernard, bring some people in. All right. Go ahead, so, say it again. So zero to whatever six months to a year mm -hmm. from the time that you meet the person. Mm -hmm. So I'm saying the uh, sex doesn't play a factor, or, or like when you have sex, is that when you guys start? Is that when you start that? The sex doesn't determine so, okay. the aspect of the relationship. Got gotcha. you. Okay. Mm. Gotcha. Because, I mean, you could have, you know, friends with benefits. Mm -hmm. You could have just that person, whatever. Mm -hmm. But it, I can't put that title on anything because everything is different for everybody. So mm -hmm. I can't, you know, just make a broad generalized statement like that. But we have these uh, newlyweds that's going to hop in. You know, you stay so in. Hop out. Well, you got to go. Well, no, I mean. I want you. I want you. Uh -oh. I want you to get that the tape. The newlyweds. I want, I want you. The dolls are here. Newlyweds. I want. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see if you agree with their tape. If they agree with your tape, because they are newlyweds. Hello. Hello. Now, Hello. now, Miss Sarah said. Miss Sarah. Hello. Miss Sarah said that. Sarah. Within 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 <laughs> six <laughs> months. Within <laughs> within six months, she said that. You she, you can get know, get to know your guy and within like a year she'll be married. Did, did that happen to you guys? Like so within that year? Yeah, it did happen. Matter of fact, this time this to this day, yes, tomorrow, mm -hmm. last year he posted me for the first time on social media. We had just got together. And, Boom. And yesterday was our five month anniversary. Boom. Boom. Well, you know what them spiritual people say. <laughs> Come on, with you know the what dogs. they say. Come on, won't he do it? Won't he do it? Won't he do it? And we had the we had the we had the uh the debate over. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's not official until you post it on social media. Yeah, it's not. Right. Right. So do you, you do believe in this? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. If you're always posting on Facebook May and you don't post your person, then it ain't Sarah, serious. you agree with that? Yeah, I mean like... Thank you! You can, be, you, can have, you can be having <laughs> you all kinds of booty buddies and this, that, and I've been on the same and thing. No. Your relationship status is still single and wanting to mingle. And but I, until you make it plain on all mm, venues, on all platforms, on the gram, on, all on the Snapchat, yep. see, on that's the like, Facebook, see, that's your problem. On the Vine, it's, it's my show. It's my show. It's my show. You getting tagged? Let me talk. It's my show. It's my show. Let me talk. Look, that's your problem. <laughs> this is your problem. This is my show. Let me talk. Run it. It's the truck cage, not the Sarah cage. This first hey one. Hey man, you invited me to this truck. You invited me to this you truck. You invited me to come up in here. It's on. It's on. <laughs> well, that, look. See, see that's it. Let, let, me get, let, me, let me get on my soapbox. Get up. Get on it. Run it. I just built my soapbox. I'm on it. All right. Look. <laughs> you, that's a problem. Y'all. Allowing social media to run your life. Social media shouldn't run your life. If you and your significant other, whomever it be, male, female, 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 male, male, whatever it may be, right? If y'all own it and y'all any in, in, okay. into each other, then it doesn't matter. Social media does not make your relationship. It doesn't. You're absolutely right, DB. Absolutely correct. But okay. guess what? What? If you don't ever post your woman, but you post your homeboy more than you post your motherfucking woman, does that make any sense? <sighs> Also, in your hey, man, face. When you're in, in the hospital, face. when you're in the hospital and you need that wet rag on your motherfucking head, is your homeboy over there tapping your motherfucking head? In your face. My thing is, this nigga still 39 and you got a woman for a million motherfucking years. 
<laughs> and your motherfucking mama still your motherfucking uh, your mama still your <laughs> point of contact. Yo, Why is she contact? <laughs> Bruh, when you gonna change your mama and your damn point of contact? <laughs> <laughs> mama! Check, please! I'm gonna sip this tea. Hey, real talk, real talk. My mama, also, my POC. I don't hey, feel like shit, my, I had to switch my back. Makes your relationship. <laughs> Come on, but Mrs. If Mrs. you are mm, mm. a person who posts all the time mm. and then you don't post your significant other, mm. then. Weird. Mm. Come on. MRN. Yeah, we full. We full. Oh, good. Hey, tell Bernard to bring some people. Huh? Tell B to bring some people. All right. That's cousin Mike. Cousin Mike. Cousin Mike. Cousin Mike. Cousin Mike. Mike. Cousin Mike. He don't, like, he don't come out once a year. <laughs> right. That's what this is once a year. He don't come out once a year. So definitely make it official. Make it official. Make it official. What are you hiding in This is the thing. We got a we got a big problem because it's kind of like a it's it, you know whole, whole it's that room. curse. Wait a minute, it's like, how is that a that, curse? Once you put right, that right, out right, there, thing. we have a problem with black women not being claimed. Co so why not claim this woman like, and let everybody know? Like everybody know. okay, we listening to Bobby Brown because they make it official. Your tender around it. Go ahead, and make it official. Mm. Let everybody know. And Bobby also, also did curse. make it plain. Also, there's no curse. The, the, the curse is when you put out your business on social media. Like yes, you see pictures of me and Apache. We post, but y'all don't know what's going on with us. Okay, that's what I'm saying. We went to Detroit. We went on a whole trip. Ain't nobody knew. Yes. But ain't nobody gotta know what I'm saying. Until you tell them. Like, like, how y'all know? Police killing a bunch of black people because people posted. Right. Yeah. If, if you didn't know that that police were killing black people, just like back in the days, right. like white people watched. Oh my God, they're killing black people. Right. They've been they killing, killing black, black people. people. Right. Killing they just posted. They, they just posted post now. now. Yeah. Social media, mom. I'm just saying, yeah. like, I don't think social media. Yeah, social no, media. It doesn't have to be that. Th this my show. Defining point. <laughs> social media. I'm playing, I like to mess with them. No, right, right. I'm just, hey, yeah, hey. Uh, I, I know social media does not make your relationship official. That's all I want you to understand. Like, you make your relationship official right. by you being with your significant right. other. I don't need to tell you that I'm with this woman every day because when, 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 when I'm with somebody I love, I love quality time. That's my my love language. But just make sure you're you're. Uh, social media life in your real life right. with your woman is lining up. Even if you're not exactly. posting your woman, make sure you're exactly. not thotting right. and DMing mm -hmm. and right. doing all that stuff. Because yeah. then, Stop when you do find we all know stuff, black men don't do that shit. Like, black men don't cheat. <laughs> but you were just talking to me. He might, he might. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't true. need him to be a whole hoe in the street. Please don't embarrass me. A whole, like, imagine, imagine you had a good woman and then one day you found out she got ran through by a whole bunch of people. How would you feel? That's why you don't, I don't post want to. But no, 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 no. That, it's, it's that's why I post my no, gal on social media. No. It's dudes that be having like five, that's one of the eight reasons. women like holding yeah. on at one time. Yeah. Everybody like holding on for dear life. Yeah. And he like, well, shit, I don't really want, I don't really want none of y'all. Yeah. I got a whole other woman over here that's way better than y'all. Mm. But he's been a whole hoe in the streets. Correct. Been a whole hoe in the streets. Define but a then, whole hoe like, in the streets. Like, <laughs> yeah, man. It's, <laughs> hey man, it's 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 worse it's worse for a man finding yeah. out your girl a whole hoe out in the street. Mm -hmm. it, like man, it's kind of like it's 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 been done before. Like I don't want to date the girl that decides to move over to the next state and then all of a sudden get morals. You know what I'm right. Right. I don't want. I don't. I don't want. I just moved But she from never got right. morals. Yeah. Like, you can't really change that right. off the top. Like right. you just kind of kind of pick your bones and right. see. Like every now and again, she gonna give you a sign. Yeah. Right. She gonna give you a hometown every now and again if you pay paying attention. I didn't ask for your finger to go there. What are you doing? <laughs> you know, Wait a minute. I'm Oh, yeah, exit on the finger. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm the man, goddamn it! I tell you to put your finger right there. All right, Sarah. We don't, we don't like Thank terrible so torches much, in our truck anyway. Oh, you know get out. No, hey, Sarah. 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 I enjoyed my love, love Taurus. We love you, Sarah. Friends yeah, and only friends. <laughs> <laughs> they Damn, like that. Hey, hey, hey man, Taurus is on some trips. We have bro. some great they stories are? about Taurus. It wasn't me, though. It wasn't was you. you. Thank you. That's all I'm saying. No, but, um, yeah. From what I met you, uh, Sarah, you are really a terrific person, real talk. You're yeah, the coolest. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm cool yeah. in the pants. Yeah. It's yeah. me. I don't absolutely. know about all that history y'all got with the mother Taurus. Don't play Hey, B, do your job, B. My house. We're going to continue to be great. Look, yeah, don't claim them Taurus. Oh, is that? Oh, all, everything culture? All right, y'all be cool. Yeah, right. thanks, Sarah. We're going to get you all. What was the truck fashion about? We, 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 right. we, we didn't have a truc fashion because it was, uh, it was birthday. Uh, uh, 
Thank but we you. just want to get you. everybody you in and out. But we you can do a truck fest. I found one. Okay. An old one. I was a little nervous. It's okay. Up. Hey, Sarah, you, you did your thing. You did a great job. Yeah, you did your thing. All right, bye, y'all. Nice yeah, come back out. Uh, let me, let's read this old one. This, y'all this. No, mm. no, no cups. Shot glasses? Damn. Hey, yo, B. You better drink out. Ain't nobody touched the bottle. I don't think nobody put that lips on the bottle. I don't think nobody did. Okay, they want to get on me. I'm gonna scoot up. Who is this? Who is this? Everything culture. Who the left they cut back here? You know, uh, just give it to me. Y'all want it? No. I think it's cousin no, Mike. We don't want to drink your mother's cups. Is this everything culture? Hey, everything. everything. Hey, get that to cousin Mike. Is she, are you part? Is she part of everything culture? Yeah, that's how no, she's that's not. not. Yeah, give us a minute. Give us a minute. Give us a minute. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. Can I scoot back? Oh, no. Okay. All right. All right. Everything co- Well, you know what? Cousin Mike. Dang, Mike. Dang, oh, no, I think uh, Sarah took it. Sarah, Sarah took it. Okay. Sarah took it. Okay. Yeah, you just screw over a little bit. What? That's what Yeah. Well, you gotta screw over a little bit. What's big ass head? My head that big? Yes, nigga. Well, I feel like I can put my arm down. Sorry. We got all this ass back here. Somebody got abs? What? I said ass. We got all this Introduce yourselves. Um. I'm Mr. D713. <laughs> I'm your girl, Honeybee. And where are y'all from? H-Town. H-Town. Oh my God. A little bit out of East well, Texas. What are y'all, where are y'all from? Oh, Mostly every... Texas. Hunters Blend. Oh my God. Oh Everything my God. culture. There you go. Uh, Thank you. They are from the podcast, Everything culture. culture. See, I keep saying thing. Everything. Thing. No, oh, so y'all get up with it. We said thing? No, I don't ever say thing. Y'all can play. Hey, y'all say everything. 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 I got these and grab them for saying thing. Sorry. See, we country as <laughs> shit. I'm country as shit. That's why we mm-hmm. use thing. There you go. Like, the main two, uh, like, we started is I got from East Texas, Tyler, Texas, to be exact. That's where you from, everything. bro? Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. Buddy, okay. Man, you know, okay. out that north side. Yeah. But we are. Uh, <laughs> out Gentry, really? North Confederate, you know. No but, better. man, you know, we've been down here. Here in Houston, I've been here 13 years plus. Um, made a lot of friends and family, um, but it, I love what we do here in our community. We have such a diverse community here in Houston, and you know, from the work I've done, mm-hmm. from the people I've met, it's like everybody got a different perspective, mm-hmm. different background, and the main foundation we have for the show is from Martin Luther King that says men hate each other because they fear each other they fear each other because they don't know each other they don't know each other because of miscommunication Mm. and hate that we have in the Mm. community so with our show we try to bridge that gap and destroy the miscommunication so we get to know each other and understand we all are different but at the same time we're alike so perhaps we can love there you go Right. There you go. Yeah. You know, so that that's one of the uh, highlights that we have. So we brought on a lot of different diverse people, and so we're trying to bring in different cultures and different things, so that we can really show each other how much more we're alike. And I guess my main uh, focus is mm-hmm. to tell everybody we're not different races. We're all one human races, and we look mm-hmm. differently just because of our environment. We have dark and melon because we were in the sun more than some right, people who right. were in maybe uh, cooler climates, and their hair are different. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, we are. All all the same people and I think that's the biggest misconception of our society so we just try to bring these cultures together that's you dope. like I'm really that's more dope. similar than I am different mm-hmm. than you yeah. and I think that it's just a, a way that the man has figured out how to divide and for, so for somebody that's who it's thinks it's for somebody it's who it's thinks it's like mm-hmm. um I think that we are different yeah. How, how would you feel? Like, do you I think, that think that most people think they're different because they haven't got time. They haven't taken the time to get to know you. Because there's this one story that I remember of these two, like this white man who really uh, did not like African Americans. And then he started working with one and he realized that man was just like him who went home every day to sit there and provide for his family who had kids who went to church. And he was like a part of the Ku Klux Klan and he actually dropped being a part of that organization because he got to know, he got to know the black man and realize that all the stereotypes things that was told to him as he grew up were not true and that this man was more like What up Jesse? Hey Jesse and they would he was just like him so he would end up being his best friend so I think that once you get to know and you actually um you know I don't know become friends and realize how much we're just okay guys we're in relationship talking talking I don't want to get that deep into it but I appreciate you guys you got we gotta get y'all on the show and I don't want to waste no more of that no we ain't had one day I mean, I can. Yeah, I got. I found one. Oh, 
Okay. I mean, if y'all want to respond, yeah. let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, do you guys give good advice? Because we know they don't. Do y'all give good advice? <laughs> yeah, we, we, so, try so. you know, we try to. We try to. We're just holding it down. We try. We try. All right, here we go. The good nose. The good nose. I didn't mean to get so deep on y'all. Yeah. Nobody can. I did. I went on her food. Yeah, we're definitely not deep on this show. You got to jump in the truck. It's like two more, y'all, right? Yeah. We got one more. We got someone in the background. But hey, it's all a team. Yeah, we try. We try not to be. We try to be informative, but you know, I we need. Like, we try to keep it like that. Yeah. 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 We try. We try to. Play. But hey, that's yeah. good. We need that sometime on this show. All right, here we go. Hey, hum V and DB. I was What's about up? to type my name. I'm tripping. LOL. Anyway, here goes. This is an old one. I don't, I don't remember this one. My best friend and I have known each other for over 15 years, oh, and we have never had any issues, especially when it comes to men. My uh, best friend found a man, and I couldn't be happier for it. They were talking for about two years before they got married, and of course, I was the maid of honor, and we were still inseparable. I was in a committed relationship myself, so we would double date a lot. This one time, I was at a party, and I took a pic of myself and posted it on social media, and all of a sudden, out of the blue, I got a message, and it was my best friend's husband. He said, no invite. I replied, I didn't know you were, I didn't know you, I didn't know for high school. Stop. I didn't know you and your wife uh, wanted to come. He then said, I'm not talking about us coming. I'm talking about just me. Your best friend knows uh, how I am. You're looking good, so tell me where the party at so I can pull up. I didn't reply back. I just left it there. I'm not sure if I should tell my best friend or not. This is the first time this has ever happened. I'm scared to even post anything anymore on my page in fear of having to deal with his encounter again. I don't want to block him because he might say something to my best friend. What should I do? Signed a concerned friend. I got the perfect. Hey, concerned for friend, this. you gotta stand to stick up for your damn self. The fuck you mean? You, see, see, I'm sorry. Go ahead, man. No, all, all, all I want to say is, go ahead, go ahead, Patch. Um, <laughs> I would love for people to boss up about their motherfucking life. I mean, yeah. um, I'm in my inbox. Why are you in my inbox? I'm gonna shut you. that bullshit down. Like nobody comes into my like, inbox. What are you doing? Mm. Like, I'm scared to post. Yo, fuck. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bro, be, it's a valid. This kind of response we need, right? I need to be empathetic towards her. Or with her. I'm no, so have her. at it. Be empathetic. I, un- Fuck I no. don't I, I don't understand. I'm trying to. No, don't like, be empathetic, be you. Like and yeah. he already, if he already done told you that's how his girl already your girl already know, go ahead and have that conversation with her. If y'all been cool 15 years, talk to her and shit. Like, what? That shit made me uncomfortable. Yeah, I would check Tell that motherfucker to keep like, yeah. like, I would definitely uh, check If your girl know how you are, why your girl didn't approach me? And tell me. Mm. Uh, That's disrespectful. What you guys are starting to realize super is, this is just a young man hey, we know he's doing young. something wrong. First of all, he, he does have, he don't have no melanin in his skin. So, <laughs> how do you, you know, know that? that? Black men don't cheat. Oh, no. anyway, <laughs> so you don't have no man uh, in this Of course, game. I forgot. Well, I like yeah. shit, duh. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Yeah. So well, it's like you got to talk to this Latino white brother, with hundred, whatever he may be, and tell <laughs> him that you don't, you don't, you don't agree with that. Well, I just think that he should, that she definitely should check him and say you disrespected me. You already know how like, I am. Like, me like yeah, you because she tell. said she had yeah. somebody. I got a right? feeling so. honey bee is no nonsense. Well, it's a double date, but you can tell yeah. she's somewhat sensitive. You know, and I know people don't like saying, but it is like. No, but word. as a woman, it's a way that you hold yourself because no man will ever approach mm-hmm. me like that. But obviously, that may have happened before. So you say she That's made you. It. Hold on, so you. Well, it oh, you placing blame on her? No, I'm not. Not at all. Okay. I am never victim shaming. She mm-hmm. is a victim in this situation. She did not approach him. He approached her. But but, but why there, did you say that? I think that she there is a. Well, I'm just saying that he should have never approached her. And she, can I, can I, and she in this why, situation can go from victim. victim. What to the dummy. What make Real her quick, my husband. She move. was just living like, life. Right. 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 That's why I said and then she, he came. she did not ask for this. Yeah, victim's However, strong word. I do saying. think, I yeah. Okay. Okay. Victim's a strong word. Sorry. They don't make her a victim. Victims okay, are right. Victim somebody who was raped. Like, no, no, sir. No. How did we get here? Okay. Yeah, that was, I heard my victim. bad. My last word. Let me go take that word. Yeah, that's and, not and, and that's yeah. my point that she's she should come. It's, my thing is a simple solution. Mm-hmm. That's me. What's that? Check the motherfucker. Check him. Mm-hmm. Then check. talk to your homegirl. Check him like Nike. 
It's like, man, it's like two steps. And then I end up in the toxication. I'm not. Like, I'm not. And, and, and the, how the fuck you say you scared to box somebody? Like, how? Like, and, and that made me, because I don't like, 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 stop I being a creep. Like, my why thing, stop being a creep? But the thing is, if she block him, then your friend be like, why you block my, my husband? I would tell you, you got ask to him. But, I ain't block that motherfucker. I would, well, shut, I would shut the whole situation down, and I wouldn't say shit to my person. Mm. Or, or the my home boy. I wouldn't say shit. You wouldn't say shit. Shut it down. This is the thing. This is the thing. I have got it in on and, and jumped into somebody's, into that bullshit. Right. And and I was the person that got blocked. Yeah. See, fuck, but I, yeah. Yeah. See, my conscience That's what like, I'm worried about. I, I tell my homeboy. I had it's a bunch of people get bossed around shit. out there. But then, then All my other homeboys were saying shot. shit. They would keep mm, their mouth closed and shit. Shot. Mm. I straight up, hey, dog, man, Receipts. you been my boy for years, Receipts. man. Receipts. Your old lady doing Receipts. some bullshit. Yeah. Hey, this Receipts. will happen. You can take it how you want to take it. I can't sleep at night knowing you my nigga, and I ain't expressing these things to you. So hey, you can get mad at me. Hold on, it, it depends on what. Like, is she coming at like? Dude, is she coming mama, at you? Or you just saw her out me. being her? When my other partners and people come to me talking about they still married and shit, I'm like, what the fuck you mean they still married and shit? Oh. Yeah. And he's like, oh, and they trying to shut down. I'm like, nah, man, we got to. With, I ain't gonna say without my yeah, man. Yeah, I don't get into that, bro. I'm, I, I, can't, do I don't get into that. I'm gonna let my homeboy. Because it do backfire a lot. Yeah, everybody always jumps you. Put it this way, I wasn't wrong about shit. Yeah, I'm not. He thanked me now. He thanked me now. He like, then he like, man, I don't wanna believe that shit. But man, you was absolutely correct. He said, look, man, I'm not. He like, what's the color? He said, yeah, y'all supposed to wipe out ass out like detergent. I'm like, what the fuck? He like, yeah, you're right, but you have kids with child. I'm like, what the fuck? He said, y'all supposed to wipe our ass out like detergent. I'm like, you're right, but you have kids with child. We're trying to keep you alive. Damn. I'm all about screenshots and receipts. Nah, we all don't do. I'm like, dude, you can take my word or not. You can go check your shit. Don't I'm take not gonna my be stalking. I'm like, I'm just <laughs> expressing it, man. That's it. Yeah. Like, I, I'm not. I, I can't. I don't want to get to see. Well, well, hey, I'll concerned friend. That young lady on you got some new advice if you forgot. Jesus. You uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I, I wonder what happened. There. They're know. probably still together. Yeah. Yeah. It usually. I, I see a lot of couples like where one person just gets so bossed questions. around or get controlled the whole relationship. See, see, and they'll come to you and pour their heart out like, I want to leave. Mm -hmm. But the other, going no fucking way. Hey, fellas, you fellas, you got to lean in, fellas. You got to lean in, fellas. Yeah, you got to lean in. The other situation is, push me out the way. was she in the relationship? Was the girl that got the quote unquote victim, was she in a relationship too? That's what I say. If she's in a relationship, that's why I say it's disrespectful. Right, which is why would you even come to her? Now, that's when shit going to get nasty right there. I think like why come at me? Because I was somebody, telling you. somebody yeah. sent yeah. her a message one day, mm -hmm. and it was just so disrespectful. I was just like, let me respond. Was like, yeah. I never respond, but I was like, give me your phone real quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why y'all was word? Yeah. Damn, bro, Sometimes why, you gotta social media. Like, but my, but my thing is, DB, I know niggas. Yeah. A nigga gonna, a nigga gonna shoot and shot. Regardless, and regardless, I don't get mad at regardless. that. I can't get mad I can't at get that. Can't get mad at that. Shot, niggas gonna need. That niggas gonna need. My thing right, is, right. I need to see what my home base looking <laughs> like. Say it again. On niggas gonna need. If your home base ain't looking good, too. niggas yeah, can no, need. Niggas gonna need in your house. Women gonna win. Uh, <laughs> it is a hot it girl summer. Ways. It's a hot girl summer. Right. It, it goes both ways. Ways. We know, we know. Yeah, no we know, we understand. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I was like, she got ready. Once it goes to the culture, it goes both ways. Oh, oh, trust me, I know. Me yeah. being, <laughs> oh, okay. 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 being a faithful man, is we got to be. You like being in a truck, honey? You get kicked out. You get kicked out now. Trust me, I. <laughs> me and one of my partners says the best um on my um um text underscore three x. He's mm -hmm. like, so you post your girl online, your DMs open up. Your like, DMs bro, open up, bro. We, we, we I be telling like, bro, because like, now you are uh, like somebody wants you. Exactly. They, everybody yeah. wants somebody that wants something. Mm -hmm. Right. That's why. My whole game was when I was single, I would bring out my attractive homegirls with me to certain spots, right. and your whole I would, game would be on point for the whole night because girls they thought they would be like A one. Oh my god, is it? Come on, he with him? You know what you're doing? Yeah. What you doing? That's a strategy. Though? Keep curving. Okay. Or curving. I know boys that wear wet. Wedding rings on their fingers, and they're not even married. Not even married. Not even, but keep curving, man. Like, <laughs> hey, I like. I don't know if y'all remember. I was when y'all was doing live with the Lemonade Podcast. Uh -huh. I was a dude talking about like, man, it's so much hard. When you curve a home, girl, they take this shit totally different. Oh, they take that shit horribly. They take it personal. They don't take it personal. They take it very personal. And that's why it kills me when Because women have been 
told that they are their looks or sometimes mm -hmm. versus like men have been told they're providers. So when you curve them, it's directly related to right. maybe That's their right. looks. Right. Right. Like looks I would tell, I would tell my homeboys, I, I would tell my friends, like, I have no issue with being rejection. My problem was when I got actually accepted. Yeah, that was my problem. Like I, I had no issue with being like I, I was cool with rejection. Right. My issue was like when she actually liked me. I'm like, oh. Damn, then I'm kind of stuck. Something. Now what? Now what? <laughs> you know? It's like, so you can be shooting your shot. Just shoot. Be, like, shoot. It's fun. <laughs> you didn't, you didn't, want, you didn't want the two points? You didn't want the two points? Yes. I, I mean, he it, was like, looking to see if he had the juice. Yeah. Like, and and, 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 and then sometimes, you know, it's like all about the thrill. Like, I, I, the in my younger days, my, 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 I had the, it's the thrill of the hunt. The thrill of the hunt. And once you get the hunt, you like, do you still have really? it? No, 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 no. I'm not like that. I'm I found my. I found somebody. I, I want to hunt every day. That's what, good, good, good. what is she? Hmm? What is she? What did she say? <laughs> I mean, it was a show about birthdays. And I was it like, is our birthday. The birthday. She got a Leo. Oh, okay. Oh, was that Leo? Uh, she had cancer. Know, she had hey, cancer. Shout out she had cancer. So tell that's why she tell uh, everything uh, culture. Day, what? What's the sign? What's the sign? Oh, I'm a Taurus. Oh, you just had a Taurus. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. Y'all attract to these Taurus. That's y'all. Probably. Probably. Hey, What's the sign? It's Leo, baby, man. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm not a Leo. Love, 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 like because me and my husband are almost are... alike to the point that like we're like bulls. Like unless we about to battle, <laughs> we battle. But other than that, we love and we loyal. That's good. Yeah. Shout out to the hood. Shout out to shout out to Honey Bee Husband. Shout out to Honey Bee Husband. And we celebrate black love on this show. Right. We celebrate excellence. We, we celebrate black men don't cheat. We can't say his name black women, but that's not what every subject. Who's smacking their lips? I, uh, I like that message though. I think that it's all about messaging yeah, in life absolutely. because there's so many negative messages about Correct. black men. Let's go ahead and say black men don't cheat. Yeah, and you know what? I, I, just, I, just, I just I just want women to, to I just want women, women to understand that men are holding themselves accountable. Yeah, it may seem silly. It may it may come up as a joke at first, but somebody's gonna say, "Yo, we gotta really take this seriously because we need more black families. We need more we black know. community." Yeah. We don't and, if, and if it starts with a hashtag, then let's let's support it. And let's push it. Okay, we're gonna make this a symbol. And, and, and they say no. Okay, I gotta I gotta hold myself to a higher standard because we keep saying this. I yeah. Exactly. I'm telling you, when I was um what a few months ago, I tried to have all the guys come out, do top golf, gun range, mm -hmm. and all that stuff. Cause it was before the black man don't cheat. This is like right. man, just bring the brothers out, all of right. my married guys, you know, let us come with brotherhood and fellowship mm -hmm. and do some bullshit, you know, right. and just not get, stay out of shit. That's mm -hmm. the basic about it. Right. right. Cause man, he's holding Well, that's here. why I really, I think that <laughs> you men married? that are married, yeah, oh, yeah. I'm married, yeah. Okay. He married, um, he married. Uh, Mrs. Yeah. D713, that's Damn, my girl. Married. Is everybody in this truck married? Yeah. 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 Everybody out. Everybody out. Yeah. No, that is a So we need y'all in there. And we should show you that it works. I've been saying it years. works. Okay, I got a question. Right. Tell them. I got a question. Tell them. Right. Everybody in the truck is married. Right. From your own personal reason, your own personal belief, mm -hmm. you'll go, you'll go from behind me to all the way over. Mm -hmm. What what was what, what made you cross over? What made you say, I'm ready for it? Or what made you say I'm gonna accept him. Mm. So, man, if I go, once again, I when same thing with everything culture. We talk about show, talk about childhood. Mm -hmm. I was raised partially by my grandparents, and they was married for like 65 years. Oh, wow. okay. So I saw that bond within a couple, right. and then when I met my um, girl and my wife at this time now, like I'm telling you, she tell you, I told her like we, I'm gonna marry you. Mm -hmm. You know, no doubt. I never told any other girl that shit, and. Mm -hmm. Taking the studio like, time, man. We good. Oh, my bad. Oh, we, 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 no, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. We listen. Yeah. We close, yeah. we, we're going to close this, huh? Yeah, yeah. Give us a moment. We'll come, come, come get you. Right. Give, 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 give us some tacos. Give, give us five more minutes. What you want, tacos? Man? Yeah, because I got what some tacos. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we are, man. This is a powerful question. This is a powerful message. Get it in, man. Over there on the right hand side. Cousin Mike, what's that shit? On the left hand side over here. Cousin Mike. What did they take that cup? Oh, it's inside, Cousin Mike. Oh, man, it's probably tilted. Yeah, that was me. All right, Cub Mike.
in a minute. So, so go ahead and call you. Yeah. Give me some tacos for but your all birthday. About the wrap it up before we get pushed out the shit. No. Um, <laughs> that it yeah, we kind of like, like a big deal. Like when I met. No, this is a powerful question. Yeah, but when I met my wife go, or my girl yeah. at the time. It was like we sat down, like we both had to graduate from college. Mm -hmm. We both was go be engaged. For, we were be engaged to each other for a year. Mm -hmm. We may may not live with each other. We did this shit at the age of like nineteen. You did, mm -hmm. and it was like we and like we got found a church together. We wanted a faith based marriage. Mm. We didn't want to be like you can't compare your marriage to everybody else and shit. Right. You know, Cannot. because like your they thing might be different from your mm. thing and they thing, whatever the case may be. But man, when I say it's been step by step and you can have your good step times, you can have a hard times, step. but what made me want to really make that step, it was like, man, we've been together, we've been down, we have our tough times, but yeah. it's like that communication, respect, and mm. what's the other one? Consistency. Consistency. That was that communication first, though. Yeah. If you I feel like right. if you communicate, bro, that's awesome. All right, go ahead, honey, before okay, you get in trouble. So, yeah, so <laughs> this is my whole quick thing. And if anybody asks me about my relationship with Mr. Honeybee, I always say that it was a business deal. I feel like that if people really approach relationships as understanding that it's a business, what do I bring to the table? What do you bring to the table? We are partners into mm. this marriage. And so I, I shine think, you. Yeah. <laughs> but if the other person. I got to shine. Exactly. That's love. That's, that's love. That's the and business. And as long as you sit there and what do you do in the business deal? You come and you put the cards on the table and you sit there and you communicate what your expectations are mm -hmm. for, for yourself and for others. And I think that love stuff is extra. I think a lot of times mm -hmm. we get so caught up into the love part and then we yeah. haven't made the business part of our relationship. So, so things don't even like, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, we go into that lust phase of our relationship where all we're doing is, you know, doing all, we, we just lust each other and then all that fades away and we haven't even thought about what you bring to the table, what I bring to the table. And I mean, we talked about everything to the point that he doesn't like cleaning toilets. I do like cleaning toilets. Who's going to cook? What is our sex plan? What is this? You know, we talked you about everything. You we talked about the specifics. Hey, my yes. Is um, there um, any um, spot um, ready um, in your um, marriage? Yeah. Marriage, marriage is them little nuts and bolts well, that you put on the goddamn. It ain't the wing of the airplane. It's the nuts and it's bolts. Inside the, the wing of the airplane. And then the other part that I tell people is there's no, like, stop looking for these unicorns. I think that people look for this idealistic, mm. this unrealistic mm. person. Right, right, unrealistic right. person when you know you have flaws, so you have to accept yeah. flaws. I got you everything but a sure six pack. You can find what's perfect. Hey, now, you. somebody gonna want you with, huh? with everything but not a six pack. <laughs> <laughs> so you just gotta find her too. You good? <laughs> I'm serious. Somebody you know, ready you to sit there and rub yeah. on your back. Y'all yeah, laughing at me? <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> so that's my whole thing. I think that people should come at it. Go ahead, honey bee. Honey, honey bee, put your down. expectations on on the table. Hey, everything, everything things. culture, dog. Everything right. right here, man. Everything. Hey, we definitely. Okay, okay, <laughs> Miss uh, Miss uh, cancel. Uh, yeah, Miss Gudo. <laughs> Mrs. Gudo. Right. I, I keep saying Miss. Yeah. I'm, 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 it's my show, y'all. It's my show. I'm not used to hanging around married folk. And so we got, I we, this we got that married right. energy in the truck yeah. tonight. Right. Okay. We got it in the truck. Through, man. Come on, everybody. Yes. I, I man, y'all, yeah, don't, don't take me serious. I just um, don't. touch him on his head. Cake hands. Without my parents being married, they were never married. I deal with the baby mama, baby daddy situation. Mm. So I always knew when I grew up that I wanted to. Um, I had a child at 19, so I wanted to give my kids, however many kids, but I wanted to give them a family because I didn't have that. So right, right, right. our values, our goals, everything aligned up. Mm -hmm. And like she said, we talked about a lot of everything specific, everything specific, everything. like from washing clothes to yep. everything. And yeah, communication, mm -hmm. definitely. We were able to communicate. This is probably the only person that I can be around all the time and right. not. Yeah. So like like Truth me like too. like my whole thing like I, I don't care I, I feel like certain like man jobs I can do man so jobs. like 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 a, like a man supposed to like take out the trash and shit uh -huh. oh I want it so we do this gender roles, gender roles right gender roles, roles. So right I got them the questions roles, man like, that's bull crap I, I, I no it's not bull crap because somebody's gonna accept you with your gender roles you just have to communicate I think my gender roles are reverse so like when you say taking out the trash, I don't mind busting some do Like I like washing dishes. That's I like, like washing dishes. Yes. Like, the reason why I like washing dishes because I wash your dishes. Like, like, I know. Dishwasher. And every time I wash dishes, I know I'm not gonna lose a dishwasher. But I will never use a dishwasher. Sweeping the floor. I don't know how to use a dishwasher. I hate that shit with the. Like you make them, but it's like, but can I use one? Because I got the 
long as this shit. Bro, that boy say, that boy say, I love washing dishes. I felt that shit. Like, I was, I had no problem. If my girl cook, maybe I'm gonna clean the kitchen. I'm gonna do dishes. I don't know, because I was doing this shit at nine years old. Right, that's why. I used to wash dishes with my grandmother. She used to help me do that shit. And I thought about it one day. I like, man, this reminds me of my grandmother. Good times and shit. I don't like back in the floors. I got cussed the fuck out and whooped one time because I don't know what the fuck a Hoover was because I had a bougie ass auntie that instead of saying get the vacuum cleaner, she said get the Hoover. Fuck up a Hoover. I never heard that shit before. And that nigga, we had Bissell. What you talking about? But, yeah. Oh man! But same thing. So yeah. pumping gas, right. fellas, we agree. Pumping gas. But some people I, I pump gas. gas. I, I pump gas. Those are gender roles. Hey, hey, the the only time roles. I do it, I it is when I get in her truck and I see it's low. Thank you. That's it. Hey, Cause they they busy. They busy. They gonna end up doing. I've gotten out of a hospital before. I've gotten out of a hospital having heart surgery and I pump the fucking gas. Ain't no in hell. Like I just it's just something. It just it doesn't make it doesn't make me. Feel good. It doesn't, good. Like it doesn't make me feel good sitting in a vehicle. While oh, well, that, that, yeah, of course, of course. If a woman doesn't care about that, then yeah. that doesn't mean anything to her. So yeah. you have to understand the woman that you're with, because for some women, we don't care. Like, like, like for me, guess what? 